Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. We are working more on my RPG Maker project. I'm just, I wonder, hold on. Okay, so that's just what that does. Okay, I see now, yeah. Um. Yeah, there's really no way I can get rid of the echo. I, try, I was trying to mess with it some before I started recording and there's no way I can get rid of it unless I more than likely get a pair of headphones which I do have some but a while back I found out that the actual microphone piece itself has been um, broke and I don't want to use that pair without a possible um, an execution in case that break has gone through the wire. So I am now going, I'm now using the PS5 controller. So any sounds you hear from this or well, yeah, from this will be echoed. Like I'll make a, the initial sound and then another sound quickly afterwards because my speakers are still playing sound. So, that's unfortunate. I don't have a fancy setup. I'm only using a, a, a single circular desk with one monitor. So, it's all I can afford. Plus, I rent an apartment. I don't want to piss off my landlord and get booted out for, you know, blocking a fire exit or whatever, which, yeah. I've already been through that mess once, and it was a nightmare. So, I apologize for any echoes you might hear if I do playtest, which if I'm going to try not to playtest with the microphone plugged in. So, just to heads up, if I do unplug it, you're going to hear a bunch of noises, and it is more than likely me unplugging the microphone I will try to warn you ahead of time and now let's jump in to what I have been doing I have made some progress on the map designing I think I showed this off sorry for the actually well, I can fix this one on um I want it blue. Yeah, I'll make it blue so it's not as dark. Actually, what does black do? I wonder. Hold on. What does black do? I want the grid. I want the grid, but I want... Can I do gray? How does one make gray from three colors? I'm curious. Hold on. So I get new, hold on. Um Will this find it? Pure red, green, or blue. Turn that color up. Leave the other two at zero. That's not how you make gray. Not on here, anyway. <laughs> not on here, anyway. <laughs> how in the frick do you make gray with this? I mean, this is white if I do this. That's white. Yeah, I can't turn down white. Uh, hold on. Um... Gray... 
tile mat. I'm gonna watch girl I'll touch this. Because I mean I don't really care for white either, so I wanna try to finger this stuff out. Um Is it tools? No, it's options. Okay. See if this helps. If not, then I'll just give it up. Who cares? There isn't a using painting the map gray, of course. Yeah, it's not going to tell me how to do it. Not how I want it. Yeah, so whatever. I give up. Who cares? Um, apply whatever. Sorry for the brightness. I wonder. Yeah, this just does that. It doesn't. And that's like crap too. Like why? Huh. Yeah, I, I don't know. It is what it is. I apologize for the brightness, but I cannot fix it. Guess I could do blue. It won't hurt. Not that dark though, honestly. Um, we're not that bright. I mean, yeah, that way I can see this stuff. Okay, yeah. I can see the squares, I can see, yeah, that will work better than just pure ass white. Cool. So, I have made some progress on my own time, and I know I didn't record last week or whatever, I've been doing other stuff, but this is what I have done so far. I decided to go ahead and um, remove the um, humongous structure walls or um load bearing walls for the cave and i decided to go ahead and um just stick with this i want to make basically a giant cave system slash maze type thing on the entire map i know i said i wasn't going to but honestly i kind of want to now I think I'm using the wrong tile sets as well for the new stuff. Yeah, I think I am. Hold on, let me... Let me fix it. I'm not going to work on this on camera because I don't want to show off all of the stuff. I want to... I want to finish this and then show it off. So, this is going to be... I think the last time you guys see this map. I might do future updates, and yes, I did put a thing of blood there. I might remove that in the future, who knows. It was just an idea I had, and I do have some, like, odd-looking runes there, too, which I might keep, I might not. I don't know. I was just putting things down and for, you know, ideas, and I may or may not keep them there. So, and I figured since it is a cave system... It wouldn't hurt to have um, barricades or whatever those things are called that help keep the, the mine system up. Like whenever, like whenever we mine a cave, we put like a, a thing up to help hold it up so it won't collapse. That's what I did here. Granted, you don't see the full 3D effect of it, but you see it in this form. <coughs> If there was a 3D script, I mean, I'm sure there is, but if I knew of one and it was for commercial use, I would get it. I would use it in a heartbeat. Because, I mean, granted, 2D games are nice, but more people prefer 3D graphics. Which, I don't mind that. You know, it, it, it's, you know everyone has their preference. I prefer both. 
I don't mean I don't generally play both. I mostly play newer games because that's what's out there. You know, modern graphics because that's what that's just mostly what's out there now. But with the current state of how video games are with the triple A studios and you know that unfortunate nonsense. Video games just are not the same anymore, and it is quite unfortunate. I mean, we have a bunch of video games made by one studio, I won't say which one, that are nothing but gambling. They're released year after year. They're only modified slightly. And you literally have to gamble to unlock certain things or you know certain certain playable characters for for the game year after year and then, yeah and you have microtransactions which if you're new to my channel my game will not have microtransactions at all whatsoever in it if I do something like that it'll be like a parody like where it'll be like a free one or whatever, like it'll be literally zero cents. And it'll be like a gag or whatever, but there's really no point. Because what would it be? Would it be a cosmetic item? Pfft, no. <laughs> would it be like an overpowered weapon? No. <clears throat> would it be a way to gamble your real money life your, your real money away? <laughs> no. There's a there's no point. It would more than likely be like something stupid, something that you can actually use the in-game currency for, as like a like, as a joke. It'd be like a joke item that you can spend, you know, a made-up currency, not even like the actual in-game currency that you use everything else on. It'd be like, take this mysterious crystal you found in a cave. And you can go and gamble that away for a random piece of crap item that makes no sense. It's like a little joke item, but you still have it anyway. And you only get one of those items, and you are guaranteed to get that joke item. Because, well, you only get one. Why would I, you know, make you unable to get it? That wouldn't be fair. I could do something like that, but I more than likely wouldn't. So last time I left off, I was working on the database. I know I didn't have comp. What the frick is this crap? Oh, I see. Yeah. So that may not fit. Then I need to see if it does. This may not fit on because it's doing this. Well, I can fix it real quick. Hold on. I can fix it real quick, I think. Yeah, because it's allowing it to move like this. Oh, you know, the, t the text is moving. That may not fit. So, actually, you know what? I know what I'll do. Um, database. Where's my sounds? System. Oh, uh, yeah, I got it. Hmm. <laughs> I can just do this then. <laughs> I'll just do this for now because these are not the ones I'm going to use at all. I mean, they might be, who knows, but for now, I'm just going to do this so that you guys don't hear the echo at all. Um, I'm not going to save or load or do anything like that. Um, I wonder if I can just like, hold on. Yeah, I can't delete these at all. Yeah, unfortunate. Wait, what does window color do? What the fuck does that mean? Hold on. Oh. 
What does that mean? Hold on, I'm curious. What does that do for this? Hold on. Background of color used in the game. Oh. Ah, hold on, let me... No, I don't need this. So I can change that. Okay, hold on now. I don't mind doing this for you guys so you guys don't hear a echo. Because I know it's really annoying. Especially when someone has a piss poor setup like I do. <laughs> I heard it today and it was like, Ugh. Yeah. <laughs> so I do not mind going one by one and doing this real quick. For your for your convenience. And I'm more than likely going to import some more sounds. Actually, hold on. Where is that one sound at? Hold on. I want 5%. I want door. That is not a door. That is not a door. I ain't gonna use any of those doors at all. Maybe that one. That's not a door, that's a freaking rock. Yeah, I ain't gonna use any, any of these ones. I'm gonna import more from VXA. I'm sorry. <laughs> I know exactly which one I want, and it ain't none of those. <laughs> and if you guys heard that, I'm sorry for the echo, but I wanted to, you know, see if any of them were actually decent or not. And none of them are. Most of those are not actually doors. They're like rocks or a magic effect. It's like, why? Why would you name those a door? You have most of these. Oh, I know why, because trained monkeys can't translate freaking Japanese to freaking English. Ask why. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let me show you an example. Um. Look down here where the mouse is. Large growth. Spherical lump. So it's called a small growth. Don't call it a spherical lump. At first I thought I said spherical lamp. I was like, that is not a lamp. Then I saw the U. I was like, hmm. So it's called a small growth. Like, large crystal? Crystal. Large growth? Growth. Tall rock. Boulder. Don't trust train monkeys. Train monkeys can't do their jobs. I'm sorry. <coughs> you go to school and you go in debt for $200,000 or more. And this is how you do your freaking job that you went to school for. You need to find a better career, I'm sorry. <laughs> find a better career, please. Your Japanese translation sucks ass. I'm sorry. That's all I'm gonna say on that on that thing. Oh yeah, so I wanna see what I did for all of this crap. Save changes. I don't have a player set, do I? Nope. <laughs> Whoopsie. I don't want that anymore. Player and do this. Refreshies. Okay. Well then, so I can get. Oh, dude, can I make it rainbow? That'd be cool. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I mean, I liked rainbows before. They meant what they mean now. <laughs> that was back in the 90s. <laughs> Guess I'm that old. <laughs> Can I make it look cool? <laughs> Hold on now. Can I make this look freaking dope as hell? <laughs> uh. 
I'm curious. I want like an awesome color here. Um, can I do black? Wait a minute. <laughs> what does this look like? I'm curious. Because it was blue at first. Okay, so that's just what that's what it was before. I thought black would be like just dark black, but no, it's like transparent. Well, that's up, that's upsetting, but whatever. Um. Yeah, so that's not actually black. That's more like gray. That's a gray I want elsewhere. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> what about 207? Is this... That's, st that's still black, yeah. Uh... Is that possible? Okay, I'm curious. As an American, well, okay, I mean, okay, I'm an American. Granted, I'm not very fond of my country anymore. Haven't been for a long time. But, I'm curious. Can I make red, white, and blue? <laughs> That'd be cool. For those that actually, you know, still love America. <laughs> oh, I can do pink. I can do pink. I might do pink because, yes. Oh, man, that looks gorgeous. Oh. I mean... I wonder if there's a way. Oh, I have to look now. Hold on, I'm curious. Is there a way to change it in here? <laughs> change tile set, change parallax. Get location info. Change wind, there is. Change window color. Oh, there is a way. Okay, I can work with that. I'm. I have an idea. Okay, that. Oh man. Okay, hold on. You gotta think how I want to word this in the. Event map. Um, I like that. Hold on. Does it do what I think it does? Hold on. Yes, it does. It that, that is it. Oh, dude, that is sweet. Okay, let's save it. Master event list. Ideas. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. <laughs> okay, how do I want to word this? I can have it to where the window color can be set to the certain uh, condition of where you are. So if you're like in a forest, it can be green. If you're in a building, it can be, if I can do brown, I can make it brown. If you're in a, or if you're in a wooden building, it can be brown. If you're in a cave, which is what I'm working on now, it can be, dude, that is, if there's a dire situation, I can change it accordingly as well. Oh, dude. I love that idea. I love that idea. Mm. <sighs> yeah.
Yeah, I love it. I want. I want. This is a definite. I yeah. I want to definitely do this because having the having the window color change depending on where you are, in my opinion, is just amazing. It's the same concept of having the battle background change as well. Was that does it? That changes on its own, depending on where you are. If you're in a in a forest, it'll give a forest theme. If you're in a cave, it'll give a cave theme. If you're in a building, it'll do a building theme. That's all done by the program on its own. But changing the window color, depending on where you are as well, I think will be a pretty cool thing. It'll make it stand out as well. I don't know if anyone else has done that with any other RPG Maker projects that they've fully finished, or if it's been done in other games. I have not seen it done in other games that I have played, but it's possible that it has been done. But if it has not been done, why has it not been done? It would... Like... It would make the game more appealing in my opinion instead of having the UI instead of having the user interface be one bland color change it depending on where you're at yeah I want to actually do this one um definite does I didn't definite no, I want Yeah, hold on, definite idea. Okay, here's an idea for Windows. When you have caps lock on, make it so that you know you don't have to press shift before you press the numbers. Like, I'm pressing 1 right now. Make it so that caps lock overrides like it does for the, the letters and allows me to just press 1 and get exclamation mark. Because it bypasses shift for, for typing. Why not for the numbers as well? <clears throat> like, that would be wonderful. And then you can press shift to get a number. Or just turn caps lock off and then get numbers again. It's an idea for Windows. I know they won't ever see this video, but why haven't they done it already? Come on. Unless there's some hidden feature in the window somewhere that I can turn it on with. Let me guess. My freaking BIOS. <laughs> Gee, thanks, Windows, for hiding such a great feature. Oh no, I want to spell it the correct way. Done. I pissed off everyone in America now. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> As an American, I prefer this spelling over our spelling. Because it looks fancier. Oh, my little kitty cat's having fun. You find your ball, little boy? Or found a mouse? You found a mouse. Good boy. You found your toy mice full of catnip. Good boy. <laughs> You're such a cute cat, I swear, buddy. You make my day every day. Oh, uh, let's see here. Um, and I know it's caps lock. I don't give a fuck right now. Oh, sorry. I said fuck. Oh, I said fuck again. Sorry. I don't care. Freaking pussies. Oh, I said pussies. Oh, I said it again. I don't care. People need to grow the fuck up.
And if I spell something wrong, you grammar Yeah, you grammar people can just go fuck off. I don't care. I would have said the proper term, but um I don't wanna offend any um people. Oh what the hell, grammar Nazis, there we go. Yeah, that's an idea that I would definitely do. Oh yeah, I remember this. <laughs> I remember that one. I wonder if I can do that one or not. I'll have to look into it. I mean, I can, it's just will be a, a process. I have a lot of ideas, it's just gonna take a long time to do this. And I'm still only on the third map, by the way. <laughs> I've been working on this for a while. Like, I have started over and over and over umpteen jillion times now, and then hopefully this is the last time. <laughs> I want it to freaking get over and done with, please. Like, I want to finish this. Okay, I want to reset this back to what it was. Back to gray. I mean, black. I mean, gray. I mean... Whatever the frick color that is, according to the program, I mean, I don't know. Yeah, I ain't gonna be using that either. I'm gonna use something else. <laughs> I ain't gonna use any of these because none of them fit. I already know what I wanna use. And it's from VX Ace. And I'm also going to import the monsters from VX Ace as well and the monsters from MV as well just so I have variety not I mean there's plenty of monsters on this one but having more variety to choose from yes please I'm all for that and I legally own all of them well VX Ace MV and this one so legally I can do that I can legally do it. I can also go online and find some too. Which I've done before. And it's not that hard. Just type in RPG Maker Bad Others and you'll find some. Trust me. Not that hard. <laughs> Actually, I wonder if that site's still around. <laughs> Alright. Enough of this crap. I am going to work more on the states. We have deceased or dead. Will be replaced by a new state with a different action restriction. Removed by restriction. So restriction is up here. Removed by one of these? How, okay, how does that work then? Removed by restriction. Okay, so restriction is up here. So, yeah, I... Huh. Interesting.
I'm not going to do side view overlay for any of my states because there's not one for death. Plus you'll have the HUD down below to show your states as well. It may not show all of them at once, but if it doesn't, it'll cycle through them all. Um, can I do anything else with this? Um, party ability. No. Collapse effect. Auto battle. Guard substitute. Preserve TP. Hmm. Slot type. Oh, okay. That's for skills and whatnot. Okay. Um. Oh, okay. For... I wonder... I mean, I probably, I probably could do it. Yeah, I kind of want to say of something persists because a player might forget that... What are you doing on it? What are you doing, bud? Huh? Thanks for the butt, by the way, buddy. No biting wires, I'll bang, I'll bang your butt. No, that's not for you either, bud. What are you doing, buddy? Come here. Want some love? Hmm? No? Okay. If actor is inflicted with the state, actor has been killed, and that... The percent one is the name of if enemy has been inflicted with hmm I want it to say has fallen in battle. Blank has been defeated. Blank has been killed. Okay, so I, I want this, so I want percent one. Is still dead, deceased. Um, I wonder if I could do that as well. I just got an idea that I might not be able to pull off. I've been playing a lot of, um, well, I haven't been playing, playing it a lot lately, but um, I've been playing Solasta, Crown of the Magister, and it uses D&D rules. And it has, I, I've not really encountered death mechanics in it because, well, I'm a pussy and I prefer easy difficulty and I have my own rule set as well to where if anyone in battle falls that is an instant game over so 
you know. Because I'm playing on pussy mode, gotta make the game harder in case someone falls. That's an instant death. So. But it has some really cool mechanics. And I think all of D&D does. I could be wrong though. No, because it's using D&D rules. Do you have like X turns to revive someone and they have rolls with the dice. But I wonder if I can make it to where instead of being completely knocked out at first or, you know, deceased at first, if you're just knocked out and you have like <coughs> three turns to revive that person. And if you don't revive them, then they go into this state. I don't know if that would be doable or not. Like that's not from what I'm seeing here. It would probably be a um common event. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Um. Yeah, it would probably be a common event. Variable. I mean, I could name a dick move, because why not? It would be a very dick move. Um, set it for... Set it for three, and then... Yeah. Set it for three. And then... Branch it. Dick move equals zero. I need an else factor as well. I'm not going to actually do this now. I'm just seeing if it, it's, you know, if I have all of that is here to do it. And then if I do, I mean, I might as well just. Do it now, honestly. So, dig a move equals zero. Did I click on the right one? I did. Okay. So, dig move equals zero. I need a new state. So, chain state. Chain state. Let's just say this one. We'll name it to deceased. Oh, I'm doing this wrong. Um, I need to do more before this. Hold on. Um, I need to do more before this. Um, I need to do more. I'm not doing this right. Um, where's the turn thing at? Hold on. Unless it's not possible. It may not be possible. If after... Wait, hold on. If after... We'll put two. Okay, so if after... Affected by two, this will be knocked out. And we'll, con we'll control the barrier. We'll control the variable. At three, and then after three turns, if possible, can I make it to where? <laughs> um, Can I make it so it does? Hmm. Variable, variable, no. I need turn. 
um, branch. Where is turn? Enemy state? No. I don't see one regarding turns. So this may not be doable. Bummers. Unless I'm just not thinking it through properly, which is very possible. Eventing is, I mean, I know how to do some of it, but this is something I am not quite sure how to do. Scene control, systems, map, battle. See, battle shouldn't just be enemy. It should be for all of this stuff, for over here as well. Control timer, no. Yeah, I don't see anything in regarding the turn or unless I'm not thinking it through properly. <coughs> hmm. Hmm, I wonder. Can I do it in here, maybe? Yeah, I don't know. Hmm. That is an idea, but if I'm not able to figure it out, then I won't do it. I mean, it's not a big deal, honestly. I mean, there, there is a way. I saw how to do it over here, but I want it turn-based so you have time to actually do it. Not based on a percent chance of it going off. But I can't think of how to run that event. So I could, I, I could do it that way. Have it to where it's a chance that it goes off. Instead of turn based, uh, let's see here. Remove that end of battle. I can make, hold on, I wonder. Is there a state icon for bleeding? No, there's not. Well, that's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. Because there goes that idea. I mean, I guess I could just use this and have that be blood. But it wouldn't make sense. Because it's poison. Hmm. Anything in here that resembles a blood droplet?
Because I can have it to where if you're bleeding, you have a chance to fall over and decease. Because you bleed out. But I'm not seeing anything that resembles a blood droplet. Was well, it very unfortunate? I could use that, but you no, know, that wouldn't. I mean, that might work. But it has that border around it, so it, yeah, no. Huh. And before you say to switch back to MZ's icon list, that one sucks, big donkey doo doo. None of the actual. Icons are actually have color to them, so no. And I could go look for an expanded list of what I have now, but that one has um Pikachu, Pokeballs, Fire Emblem, um Bleach, the anime weapons. So that would be multiple copyright and um heavy lawsuits right there. So that is a big fat no as well. And God knows who knows what else is in there. I think even Kirby's in there on that expanded list for the same one that I'm using now, just a lot more is added to it. And it's, it's mostly copyright itself that they added to it. <coughs> so yeah, I ain't gonna use that one. Oh, uh, let's see, what else? I could use this as the blood icon, but the golden or the icon or thing around it kind of throws it off. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I could use that for blood. I mean, it, it doesn't really fit, but it's all I have. So I think deceased is almost done. It's not quite done yet. Actually, no, hold on, I got an idea. This will be blood, and then the one above it will be poison. And it's the same, but it's slightly different color. It's sadly still deceased. Okay, so that one is... That one is done. Okay, so now let's do bleed. And again, I don't, I, I don't have an actual like proper icon, so you know it is unfortunate. And now that I'm looking at them, they do look somewhat different. So I mean, I guess I could say that everyone has pink blood. I mean. No, because I have red blood. Eh, it is what it is. Who cares? No, you know what? Nah, it is what it is. I can't really change the color of that because it would screw the whole tile set or icon set up. And I don't want to deal with that crap. I don't have any artistic skills. I don't care. <laughs> That's dealing with pixel art and... I don't want to deal with that crap. 
I've tried before with GIMP and let's just say I wanted to go buy a gun and do certain things to myself so no no thank you um bleeding let's see what the um motions do if it gives me a highlight it doesn't say shit okay well, I don't know what these do then <laughs> I don't know what these do um I guess abnormal. Hold on, can I look this up? Hold on. Um, help contents, and then it would be uh, size. S okay, so motions. That doesn't. Uh, it doesn't help me with shit, honestly. Okay, cool, dude. This guide is so helpful. It just says what's in here. It just says what's in here. Like, literally. It doesn't say shit. Um. Yeah, no restriction, honestly. Um. I do want to see what that does. So, hold on. Um, no, what am I doing? Um, enemies. No, troops. So, change state, entire party. Bleed. Okay. And then parameters, no. Yeah, parameters. Rates, state rate, deceased. I can have it to where you're bleeding and you're taking damage at a normal rate, like every turn. And then you have a 20% chance to get this. It's like you just completely lose all your blood, like the wound just bursts open. So minus ten. Oh, I can't do minus. Oh, okay, hold on. Um, Oh, here we go. HP regenerator. Oh.
physical damage, I think, is what I want. No? Element rate is this, this parameters is Hold on, let me I'm confuzzled here, hold on. There's no minus factor, so I'm I'm confused. I don't want it to give plus health, I want it to give minus health. Like I want I want actual damage, not so state settings. Parameter detail. doesn't say How to set crates, okay. Parameter tab. Raises or lowers at a fixed rate. Yeah, but you need a minus for it to... You need a minus for it to change it. Without a minus, it won't change it. It'll heal. Hmm. Yeah, without a minus, it's not going to hurt anything at all. Like, parameter, and you, you can't do minus. So it's not going to hurt at all. Let me see how Let me see how this is set up. I'm curious. Oh, it's okay, half regeneration. So I want okay, so I was on the wrong one. Okay. 
Okay, I see now, says the blind man. And I put that on my desktop and it's not there. Fun how that works. <laughs> Fun how that freaking works, dude, I swear. Yeah, it, it's not here. It's it's not here. I don't know what the fuck it went to, dude. <laughs> I have no idea where it went to. Yeah, it should be my desktop, but it's not. <laughs> oh, I think I know why. Hold on, let me do... This is there, but I need to reset this. No. It's not there. Huh. Well, that's just freaking dumb as hell. Okay, so I was on the wrong thing. Okay, I need to see if that fits or not. I'm curious. I'm actually freaking curious right now. Does that actually fit? No, it fits, but in there it does not fit. Huh, okay. That is weird. Oh, you can do this too, nice. And that's basically what full screen would look like because it would have this on the side. So there's really no point in even making it full screen. Or is there? Hold on, I'm curious. Um, I'll get back to... No, it's 1920. Yeah. And then by... 1080. Okay, so we'll save this and then do this. Okay, I mean, that is a bit better, but that's in the way. I have no idea how to turn that off at all. I have no idea how to turn that off. Like, I don't know why that's there. I really don't know why. <coughs> so, yeah. I wish that was not there, I really do. Unless. Oh, that's probably why, the UI. Is that why I wonder what I'm curious? I'm not gonna keep it this way because of the bug that they added in with the troops and whatnot. Like, look how small they are now. Compared to this. That shouldn't be a thing, I'm sorry. <laughs> that should not be a thing. At all. But, will this fix it? Yes, okay, that's what it is. I still don't know why that's there. And I have no idea how to turn it off, but... Then you have this issue where... The wind, the menu is just way too big. Where it's just, you know, stupidly oversized for what it is. I wonder, will it break if I do, it was 824, no, 816. By six two four. What does it do now? I'm curious. That's what I thought it would do. <laughs> That's what I thought it would do. It's acting as if. Actually, no. Hold on. Oh, enter does not work, okay. Well, then I can just do this, and it's still too big. <laughs> okay. That makes sense to me.
Yep, and now it, it's, yeah. I think I'll leave it like this, honestly. There's really no, there's no point in, in having it be full screen whenever this is good enough. Yeah, th this is honestly good enough. I don't want the, the UI to be st stupidly too big where everything just expands out and has a bunch of space between it. This is perfect. I mean, yeah, there's those black bars, but this is, this is perfect. Now, if I can get this to go away, I would, but I unfortunately cannot. And that is whatever. So back over to this nonsense. If I could change the font, I would. I would change it to something else, like Times New Roman or whatever, but I have no idea how to change that. I can change the font size, but I think it's good enough as it is. Okay, so now I'm back to states bleeding. So let's see here. We have parameters, x parameter, HP regeneration minus 10%. And then so basically this is a dick move. This is my dick move right here. I love it. So 10% chance, 10% health loss, and a 20% chance to just completely bleed out everywhere. Yeah, this is my dick move. I love it. So that's set in stone. Okay. I love it. I might lower the. Actually, um, hold on. I'll do that. I'll keep it at 15%. And no more, no more, no, no lower, no higher. That is set in stone. And I'm going to do that. So state rates are set in are set in stone. So now. It will not be removed by battle, restriction, no timer, by damage, or by walking. And if actor is inflicted, okay, so that's what I thought. It does, it does, it does, yeah. So I need to put the, the this and this in there because it won't do it on its own. Another feature that would be nice to have, but it took them over five years to add the one feature I wanted. That should have been there from day one. It's the same devs for the entire fucking program since day one. And they removed a wonderful feature that was in the program since day one. Since the program first started many years ago. Why? <laughs> How dumb can you be? You add awesome features to your program. But then you take out one important one that has been in your program since you first made it. Fucking idiots. I'm, I'm sorry. They're fucking idiots. Or whoever told them not to put it in there is a fucking idiot. I'm sorry. Like... But it's finally in and I'm fucking happy. I fought for that shit. And you're all fucking welcome. You can all peruse the Steam forums. I fought for that shit. I'm the only one who wanted it. No one else thought it was a 
a worthwhile feature. I proved your ass is wrong. It's worth having. <laughs> The factor is inflicted with bleed. Blink is bleeding and might. I don't know if this will fit. No, it might. That may not fit in the game. So I have that, so if enemy Oh I did not copy it, did I? No I did not. Now nah, I did. <coughs> oh I didn't spell blood right. Whoopsie. From blood. <laughs> blood loss, not blood. Blood. Um, and well, soon form no from, and we'll soon die. Did I spell tragic right? Is it a G or a J? I don't know. The American language is fucking dumb as hell. Just like our education system. Oh. We'll soon die a tragic death. If state persists. This is easier to do this. No, I don't want caps. It's bleeding profusely. Um, no, I don't want periods. I want... Crap, on a cracker. If state is removed... Is... No... No longer bleeding. <laughs> I cannot spell today. No longer bleeding. And then this one is done as well. <coughs> Abnormal. Okay. So now this one we poison. This one. This might be a double dick move. Should I be a double dick? I don't know. I might be a double time dick. Hear me out. Copy. Pasta. Double dick move is done. <laughs> However, this one has a five per, no, a seven percent chance of death. Same health loss rate, but less chance to die because it's poison. You're not actually losing blood; you're just poisoned. So it's not ever. It's not a high, it's not a super high chance. It's, it's minuscule, but there. You can still die from poisoning, but no, I'll make it 10. What can I do? Holy shit, you can do that now? Oh shit, okay. 
I'll keep it like that then. No, 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 no. Done. I have to, I'm sorry, I have to. Knowing that I can do that, I have to. Remove by damage, remove. Home beginning of that, abnormal, yes, restriction, none. No overlay. And then health regeneration is 10%. No. Fifteen percent. No, minus. Minus fifteen percent. Okay. So that one will, that one will do more, but it has less chance of killing. It has the fun number chance of killing. Not that I would know what the fun number is like, but you know. So now I need to change that down there, which is not that hard to do. I wonder how long I've been recording for it. I'm not gonna use my timer at all. I'm just, I'm just winging it. I don't care. <laughs> I'm not even, released, I'm not even, I haven't released a video at all today. I'll do that tonight though. Be this one. It's actually, I know I've been rambling about a bunch of stuff and I've barely gotten anything done, but that's usually how I am whenever I'm recording this. So, is poisoned and will soon succumb. Succumb? Okay. Succumb? Succumb? Will soon, okay, will soon succumb. To the poison. No. All right, those are now, let's see here. It's poisoned and is going to have, not die, have, is going to have a gross death. Because it's poison. Poison is gross. Um, the state persists. Is, no, not unfortunately. Yeah, unfortunately, if it's best, unfortunately, crap on a cracker. Okay, is no longer no. Has been has recovered from poisoning. All right, that one is done. Now I'm gonna do one more, and then I'll put a stop in this video. That I might just do one. Put a stop now. Let's see here. Um. See, obviously, blind, confused, sleep. I'm not gonna do sleep because there's just no point to it. In, in all games that I've played, sleep can be negated when, when you're attacked. So why even have it as a status effect? If that's the case. I mean, yeah, I could put it in my game and not have it to where you're not woken up from that way. 
which honestly I could, and that's how and that's the way it should be, not how not be where you're woken up whenever you get hit. That should not be how it is. I'm sorry, you're asleep. Yeah, normally in real life, if you get hit, you will wake up, but in a video game, no. Video games should never mimic real life. I'm sorry. It's, well, they can, but not on something like that. Why have a status effect to where if you get hit, you wake up? No. <clears throat> if you get hit and you're asleep, you stay asleep in a video game. In real life, that's fine. You wake up. Video games are completely different from real life. Some things should not mimic the real world in video games. At all. <clears throat> so if I do put sleep status in my game, I will more than likely make it last a very long time. Just to be a dick. Okay, so do I want blind, silence, confuse, the useless status was asleep, um, whatever the hell that one is, or that one, I guess that one's fear, I guess that one's charm, that one must be berserk, um, invisible or illusion maybe? A shield? No, that one over there is berserk. And that one is reflect. Or barrier type thing, because I mean... I mean, come on, it's pretty obvious. Um... Then I have the elemental ones down below as well. This is burn, frozen, shocked, wet. Whatever the hell that one is. I don't, um, wind, yeah, I'm not going to do those ones. <laughs> oh, it's raining now. Actually, I want to go ahead and put a cut in now, just in case I might lose power while recording this video, and I don't want to lose this video, because it's been a long one. So, yeah. I want to check the radar real quick, and then... If I'm able to, I will go ahead and record another one tonight. So, I know I know I've been rambling on a bunch about random crap. I always do that. I'm sorry, I can't help it. Well, I'm working on this. I'm going to do that. Deal with it or hit the door, hit the button to unsub. I don't give a crap. Does not bother me one bit. But anyways. I'll see you guys later and have a wonderful day.